In this lesson, we're going to be experimenting with one-point perspective. We're going to be making our own one-point perspective pattern or illusion. So, I hope you have fun today. Follow along in the video and let's get started. For this project, you will need the following. A piece of A4 or A3 white paper, some markers, if you don't have markers, some coloring in pencils, a black marker, a ruler, and a pencil. We're going to be exploring the element of art, shape. Look around your room for objects that you can trace around. I found a bottle, some tape, a coaster, and out of my stationery, some triangle. Start your perspective illusion by placing a dot or a vanishing point on the page. It doesn't necessarily need to be in the middle. Now take the objects that you found earlier and start tracing around them. You can scatter them around the page. Some of them can even overlap off the edges of the page. You may also draw freehand shapes such as hearts and stars. Using a ruler, join your shapes to the vanishing point by extending lines from the edges of the shapes. Always start with the shapes that are closest to the vanishing point or the dot. Add colors to the sides of the shapes that are receding to the vanishing point. Analogous colors that are next to each other on the color wheel will work well as you'll be able to blend them together. Using your black markers, add pattern or zentangles to the tops of your shapes. You can think about shapes that you can incorporate. You can repeat the shapes, or we can say we can use repetition in the patterns. Well, I really enjoyed creating my one point perspective pattern. I particularly enjoyed how we incorporated the elements of art, of color line and shape. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. I'm going to see you in next week's episode.